Today we go to war as an army of stickmen. Left versus right, good versus evil, me versus them. So I'm obviously the good guy because, you know, history is written by the victors and well, look who just won that one. Oh, look at this. You can buy Gandalf in the shop. You can't call him Gandalf, can you? They're like, we don't care. Now, it's a classic merge army where I can merge my soldiers together to become the most powerful versions. So we'll move the archer to the back. And now my soldiers have Mega Man boots. But we must continually evolve our soldiers. Make them stronger. Get more of them so that we can continue to defeat our enemies. Honestly, we need some shields. And it's time to unlock more units. We asked for men with shields and we got men with shields. The Iron Guard has entered the battlefield. We will tactically maneuver them right next to our sword boys. Although maybe we should put them in the front. They're a little bit slower moving. Oh my gosh, he just got hacked up by those sword boys. I think they're probably really good at counting archers, but as far as counting sword guys, even though he's got a giant viking axe. Now the question of if we're gonna win this battle, I honestly think it's a no. Like look at that archer back there. He's got like keys. D don't they look like keys? I don't know why they're keys. Oh, because we kill him and we get a key. That makes a little bit of sense. So we'll buy one more unit. We would like to buy that again. And now we have a whole lot more soldiers to work with. Now before we upgrade them, I think quantity does have a quality all its own. So quantity is what we're gonna go with, which is kind of scary because they, they have a cave troll. Who's got a giant club, two hits, and he destroyed my ax wielding warriors. All right, he's killed everybody. I don't know how much health he has. Yes, we have a chance. Shoot first. Shoot again first. Yes, we barely pulled out a victory. I think we're gonna merge. Ooh, the Iron Guard now have like these headbands and their shields look like targets. They definitely look cooler. I think we've got this one. They've just got a bunch of crappy sword boys, most of which aren't even upgraded. A few have helmets and then a few archers. So they outnumber our archers, but our archers are also better. Now we don't have Legolas or anything, but I mean, if there's Gandalf, then we probably have Legolas, right? All right, so let's see, what do we get in the carousel of joyous wonders? All of the money! Good, that'll help me buy more soldiers. And more soldiers is exactly what we need. Now, shieldmen to the front, swordmen merge, and off to glorious combat. I do like these, like, battle simulator games where you've got merging of units. I just feel like they need a little bit more depth. I wonder if we all put it our, our creative minds to work. What we could come up with? Okay, now, oh man. They've got guys with torches and exploding barrels on them. Uh, all of my front line is destroyed. My archers took out the last bomb boy, but clearly we need to do something about that earlier. Okay, I think what we're gonna do is move the slow movers to the back and switch that. I want the back unit of swords to arrive after some of the bombs have gone off. Okay, that, that didn't work out too well. But changing it tactfully did change the outcome of the battle which I do like. So maybe we'll just keep this formation. It's like the little two guys at the front are the scouting party. Do they have bombs? Those guys will find out. It's like, what do you have to do in my army to like get that position? All right, lots of archers and lots of melee. Their troll is down, but it, we're outnumbered by archers, like two to one right there. <laughs> we're desperate times call for desperate situations. Gandalf, we need you. I also can buy an orc, so that should definitely help out my army. Gandalf's in the middle because he's the coolest. The orc is at the front. Now, we can't really say we're a force of good anymore. Unless, of course, orcs are neutral in this universe that we're fighting in. Okay, their giant killed my giant. And by giant, I mean orcish troll man thing beast. Gandalf is amazing, by the way. Ooh, a mission has been unlocked. But I want to go to the camp because I've never bought a silver pack before. Oh, and a barrack? I got a barrack? Oh, we got a bomb boy. 
Boomer! Alright, we fused our orc. Now, it looks like we can fuse our archers. And now I can get the bomb boy right at the front. Okay, good. My army is already more powerful than when we began, which is obvious because we have a lot more units. A lot of them are cool. I really hope those bombs aren't blowing up my own guys. And now the tables have turned. I almost feel like instead of Gandalf, I'm actually a dark wizard. I'm kind of more like Saruman in that I've started to recruit Urukai. Where? Ooh, a new enemy has entered the battlefield. I always love in these kind of games when you get the little ability to just like identify what it is you're fighting. Because those guys are wrecking my back line. We've seen these in games like this before. The ninjas, the teleporting ninjas at that. Oh wait, this guy has the key. One of those archers. There it is. He's slain. We've got the third key. Tell me this is something epic. Something incredible. It is. Okay. So this reminds me of old school Mario. You have nine chests and you have to pick one. You don't know what you're going to get. I'll choose the middle one. Oh, I have three keys. Oh, I got the best prize. Uh, oh, if I match it, maybe? Oh, no, 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 no. I just get to choose whatever I want. Okay, so we got the best prize. And I watched an ad, so I actually get three more chests. <laughs> you can watch ads and see open all the boxes. All right, let's determine this. I want to see if there's another orc in there. There's not. So actually, we guessed perfectly from the beginning. All right, we fused the orc. So he's a little bit stronger now. We've also saved up 5,000. Now I wonder, bronze, silver, there's gotta be gold, right? When do I get the gold? Should I save up my gold for the gold? I think, yes. All right, lots of teleporting ninjas. I wonder what I, oh my gosh, they just killed Gandalf. Oh, they done made me mad. Gandalf's my boy, my homie. I feel like I need to be out here with hobbits. All right, I think we wanna switch Gandalf so there's a few swords at the back. Oh, we got spearmen now? Okay, look at the spearmen in the front. They look incredible. I love that helmet. It's kind of like this Viking berserker style helmet. Although technically, do berserkers wear anything when they go and fight? I don't think so. All right, we should win this because we've got a big old arrow shield, AKA the orc. We have 10.8 thousand gold. All right, we do have a few teleporting ninjas, which is why our swordsmen are in the back. Keys, protect Gandalf, that's all I care about. Yes, Gandalf has been protected. So now my two best units are getting their critical hits. You can see a glowing wand and a glowing tree stump of a club. And Gandalf took an arrow to the left eyeball. Unfortunate for him. How do we keep that man alive? I, I don't know if the bomb kills my own stuff. All right, this guy just needs to soak up a lot of arrows. Oh, there goes Gandalf. We need more orcs. If we had an entire front line of orcs, I don't think we would lose until like level 50. So let's buy some units. That's what I needed. I needed a, a regular Viking so I could deploy him and merge those two and then merge these two. So now I have the Iron Guard who look really cool. Iron Guard, your duty is to protect Gandalf. I wanted to see if I could, might, might be able to get like one more swordman. Oh, my swordman did not protect Gandalf. All right, we need the Gandalf that has like the staff and the sword, the one that fought at Minas Tirith, so that he's more than likely to survive against melee combatants who try to ambush him. All right, this is it, level 25. This is the one that I was hoping we would be able to get to. <gasps> They've got shotgunner men. It's like the Renaissance era tabs faction. All my bomb boys got cut down immediately. Luckily, oh my gosh, okay, this is... Uh, they have stunning effect? My orc got stunned. But we managed to take them all out and our archers did well. I wonder if there's gonna be crossbowmen. Uh, this looks kind of scary. Four orcs, one of which looks very, very upgraded. The bombs went off and all of their orcs are down though, except for the one chieftain. 
I definitely think he's better than us because his uh, weapon looks cooler. Wow. Oh, the best prize is two wizards. Oh, I better get it. We're going to play tic-tac-toe. No! Second time's the charm. Yes, we got him. Beautiful. We're putting them onto the battlefield. But I need to either merge an archer or a swordman. Yes, that's exactly what we wanted. Okay, that didn't work uh, like I thought it would. <laughs> I guess we take off him, this soldier. And now our orc is flanked by three wizards. We got the blue wizards and Radagast the brown. Yes, okay, there's another key. Okay, these snipers, man. They took out one of my wizards. Yeah, I mean, you can't have three Gandalfs, right? So it's like, they're clearly some other kind of wizard. Uh, wow. All archers. I think if we... Well, actually, I guess not. There we go, chain lightning. Dude, what if all of the wizards fired their chain lightning at the same time? That would have been incredible. There's still a chance. It's just not likely to happen. There's a second key. Big front line clash. But we win it. But we have the greatest champion. I wish I could name this orc. I want to name him something amazing. But I, I don't know what it would be. Level 30. Okay. One, two, three, four, eight wizards. And they're better. All of their wizards are better than mine. Oh my god. He chain lightninged me. We were talking about Chain Lightning using it, and then he started using it on us. I don't know if this orc's gonna survive this. He's got two wizards. Oh, one more. Just one more. Just one more. Yes. Okay. That's nuts. Uh, this is called Stick Combat Battle Simulator. If you guys do want to see more, well, pull the trigger on the like button and let me know. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.